Ooh, peace and blessings, people. Peace and blessings. Assalamu alaikum. What it do? What it do, man? This is the one and only as a car Brian. Give you flame. You already know, dog pound. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell. You be left in the loop every time your boy drop the work. You feel me? Shout out to the black YouTube out there, Big Brother Ticket TV, Carcino, Kwame Brown, the League Attorney, JR Wisdom, Mr. Palmer, Too Raw for Sports, Too Raw for TV, Kicking with Mr. Moss, LC Predator to Catcher, JD Black, Tariq Nasheed, Dr. Umar Johnson, I should be KNOI, holding it down. Holding it down, dog pound, on the internet, on the social media. Making eight rounds on social media, man. <laughs> Let me tell you something, man. The internet, it has it has brought out the wickedness in everybody. From a young age to an old age, man. There's too much going on in this world. I look at the news every day. I don't even want to look at that Nikki 50. Because it's too much crap out here. There's too much crap. And the news, you know... They always make jokes of uh, me being an old school or whatnot. You old, dude. You old. You old. But hell, y'all young people, y'all dying left and right quick. I mean, quick y'all dying, man. And it's sad because y'all going out like Willie Lump Lump. Who the hell is Willie Lump Lump? It's just all across the board, man. I'm, it's this world. It's, it's, it's crazy. And it's, like I said, they're getting younger and younger. And I'm going to elaborate on that more when I come back on As A Car TV because I could not believe this story right here. Uh, this is insane. This is insane. And we're going to cook uh, as I return. Thank you for taking that time and sacrificing it. And I'll be right back. I do have certifications at the end of the day, like... You have what? But that's besides you have, the point. You have what at the end of the day? I have certification. What does that mean? Uh, so like for instance, as in aesthetics. Sp say that again. You have what? I have certification. Certification? Yes. Certification? One of the being... Certifications? Yes. yes, certification. Certifications. Mm hmm. Have you been to therapy? No. I would suggest it. You seem to be holding on a lot of negative uh, energy from your mother and father's marriage that has none of your business. There's no reason at 23 years old that you should not be coachable, especially as a young lady who has certifications and no college degree. You need to be very coachable. Why do you Man, you, you can't make this up. You cannot. Whatsoever, you cannot make this up. But this 13-year-old, man, what she did to seventeen year old, what the did she, what she did to the seven year old, or seven year old sister, it's crazy as hell, man. Just listen to this. Listen to this. We have over ten stab wounds. So, um, ranging from the abdomen to the head um, to the neck, it stemmed from a note that was placed in the bathroom, and um, and then the note was about. Flushing the flushing the toilet, like a simple note about flushing the toilet. She was not a problem in the house to the parents, and as well as uh, the mother said that no school, no problems at school. She's never been in trouble at school either. Wow. Wow. But check this out, though. Listen to this. Listen to this. Listen to this. A 13-year-old girl accused of stabbing a 7-year-old sister to death over an argument over flushing the toilet. Did you hear me? A 13-year-old girl has been accused of stabbing a 7-year-old sister to death following an argument believed to have started over flushing the toilet. 
The incident unfolded at the home of Taylor, Michigan on Saturday when the teen was babysitting her younger sister. Taylor Detective Zachary uh, Decamo told Fox 2 Detroit. The police said that a note had been placed in the bathroom about flushing the toilet and a verbal argument broke out between the siblings. During the argument, the 13-year-old allegedly stabbed her sister in the abdomen, head and neck with a butcher's knife and a hunting knife. Police said the teen then called 911. Authorities responded to the scene around 1 p.m. and found the victim in the bathroom suffering from 10 stab wounds. Boy, this is crazy as cat shit. She was rushed to a local hospital where she was pronounced dead. Uh, Wayne County Prosecutor's Office said in the press release. <laughs> Man, you know, t children don't know how to hold their temperament now these days. They really have. I got a bad temper, too. But if somebody put that bull crap on a man, that thing be exhausting. And I got to work on myself, too. The teen now faces charge of first-degree premeditated murder, felony murder, and first-degree child abuse. She was very calm and just showed no emotion. Wow. Is that the state of fashion these children are in? They have no emotion. You take that goddamn internet from their ass and they, they, boy, they go crazy. They go crazy, but it's your boy Moose. Do my favor. Uh, leave me some comments. Let me know what you think about this video. Like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. It's time to say it, ain't it? Peace and a bottle of half grease.